So initially when I started doing Zoom show, it was like actually honestly going back to 2012 doing my open mic. Because mm. it's technology, you there's technology, there could be internet issues, there could be, you know, people them, you know, because as a performer, you want their mics and videos to be on because you want to hear laughter, you know. Correct. But some people are not comfortable starting their mics and their videos, whatever. So I beg people, you know, at least we give, give me like a 25 or 100 tickets, at least 25, 30 people should have their mics and videos on, which typically happens. And then... Uh, you could have somebody, you know, eating food and talking to, Are, mera do roti lao, and that entire voice gets scared. You know? <laughs> somebody burping on the, on the, you know, loudly on the, on his mic. So all those things that you have, <laughs> that you remove jokes out of those also. But those are the challenges, but I think I was, I'm quite uh, happy that I got into it, uh, uh, fast into it. So I think I had my first show, I think at the end of March only I had my first show, or I think first April. So within like 15 days, I had my first show to sort of understand how it is because going ahead and that has also helped me because it has got me a lot of newer audience also because, you know, earlier you had, you know, one fan, sir, I'm staying in Jabalpur. When will you come to Jabalpur? I said, dude, I'm not going to come to Jabalpur to perform for you. If it's a big show, I'll come for it. But now that Mm -hmm. guy in Jabalpur can watch my show on Zoom, you know, forget people are, I've got fans from Argentina, Australia, you know, from some West Indies islands, obviously Indians. Who have been, who, so that has opened up. That's, it's just opened up, and I think just like how work from home is sort of becoming the new norm. You know, I'm sure it. So the experience is, I would say, sixty percent of performing on live because nothing can replace a live audience. The laughter, the experience. It's a four-dimensional mm-hmm. experience. There's still, I would say, two-dimensional, and uh, I think uh, that cannot never replace it. And I'm sure I'm very, very again positive that this pandemic will get over soon, or we'll find a cure for it, or work around and. We'll be back on stage soon, but we'll come very late because first they'll have to open up Bollywood, malls, much bigger sure. industry which got affected because of this. They have to keep them happy. We are anyway a much smaller community and also the government doesn't like us very much. So they will say, <laughs> you bloody open last. 